so today we did the National Security Council. And so basically we have a problem on our hands and all the departments get together and we talk about how each of our departments gonna help the uh, problem that's going on in that specific area. Everybody has their own report that we're doing, so we have to collaborate together, say all the information. We have to think about the possibilities that could happen, what couldn't happen without starting a conflict that's too big. We are currently working on a simulation regarding a proliferation of weapons of mass destruction, including nuclear, biological, and chemical weapons by both Egypt and Iran. We are also currently working on a very relevant issue, and that is Chinese military buildup in the South China Sea, and also the nuclearization of the Korean Peninsula. And we've built off what we had from the past two days. So my group was the ripple effect. So we had Iran wanted to go to war with Israel, and we were trying to figure out how to get Egypt on our side without angering China and Russia. This was the third day of that, and we basically kept getting responses from whoever the coordinator was seeing how we were doing, and then we just have to come up with new solutions every day. It allowed all of us to team build and communicate with like new people that we just met a couple days ago. And the whole point of this is like a leadership conference, so you have to like be vocal and be a leader in your own field. So we all have a role in that. We have the different parts of people who deal with it. Foreign matters, with the domestic matters. So all the leadership things that we've done in the past few days in our little TA groups, we talk about it. And so it helps us expand our knowledge on what we do and who's the best person to tackle a certain problem. I do believe it is important that we're going through a simulation right now. It gives us a hands-on experience kind of an early start to what a career in national security and intelligence might look like. Instead of just sitting down in a classroom and receiving lectures, you're actually there and doing what actual secretaries might do in the real world.